You tired? It's been a long day. Yeah, I mean, well, they already saw what you did, so, you know, it is what it is. Um, it was, get, it, 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 get, was, it was a lot of work to chase down the Ruby Carriage. It, it definitely did seem like that. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, you don't have to chase them down because we've got them right here for you on this itty-bitty screen right here. And if you don't want to see them there, you can go to Rooster's Teeth channel and watch an spectacular H. Monkey face indeed, y'all. Link to the original video is down in the description, but uh, you don't even know who I am because I was so rude and I didn't introduce myself. So without further ado, yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. <gasps> Dang. You ran out of breath. Fresh from the barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video. Uh, this is uh, Ruby Me? Chapter. My introduction. This is Ruby Chapter. In the What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Bree Easy, a.k.a. Yeah. Fresh from the salon, BKA the People's Champ. <sighs> this is Ruby Chapter 11, Jaundice. And this is going to be part one. We'll be doing part one and part two right together in the video. Did you want to say anything before we begin? Is that Jaundice? Yes. Mm -hmm. like Johnny Dice? I don't know what it is. One, one dice? I don't know. One dice. I, I don't know. Because I don't think that's how you spell jaundice. I don't think it is yes, either. Yes, man. And I don't, I don't think it's one yes, dice either because you would be in front of the dice. age. Yes, I, think it's, I think it's Johnny yes, Dice. Yes, man. I, I, dog, I don't know what yes, it is. Man. Yes, ma'am. Maybe it's uh, one <laughs> dice? I don't yes, know what it is. I don't know. Easy. I don't know how to say it. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, whatever it is, we're going to watch it. Uh, links to the original video will be down in the description. Please go check that out. If you didn't check out, if you want to see the pictures that Bridget has in in a better, check her out on Instagram. Check her out on Twitter. She will be posting those right after this, and we'll uh we'll begin we'll begin busy. But without further ado, headphones, headphones on. Wait, am I on. I hope you are. Okay. Let's get. It. Doing that before we even start. Okay, what is this gonna be? Uh, did they already fight or are they about to? Or is this just role playing? <laughs> Some kinky role playing, I guess? I don't know. Uh, Woo! Uh, Dang! Good thing you got that shield. Uh, it's not an Asian shield either. Mm. Uh, Yo, they swinging kind of full force. Where you lose. Over my dead. Uh, uh, oh! Yo, he kicked him in the. That's a cheap kick! Yeah, that was a cheap shot. Use your aura! That's enough. That was a cheap Students, shot, though. As you can see, oh, look at the levels. aura has now dropped into the red. In a aura, okay. style duel, this yeah. would indicate that John is no longer fit for battle and that the official may call the match. Mr. Ark, it's been weeks now. Please try to refer to your scroll during combat. Gauging your aura will help you decide when it is appropriate to attack or when it is better to move to a more defensive strategy. Exactly. Okay. We wouldn't want you to be gobbled up by a bear wolf, now would we? Speak for like yourself. Power level. Ooh, the hate Another is one. real. The mm. vital festival is only a few months away. It won't be long before students from the other mm. kingdoms mm. are mm. arriving in Bell. So keep practicing. Those who choose to compete in the combat the team will be representing all of Bell. Aww. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she gotta go pet him up now, right? So, there we were in the middle of the night. It was day. We were yes. surrounded by Earth's She's so engaged. They were Beowulfs. Dozens of them! Two of them. Uh -huh. They were no match. And in the end, Ren and I took them down and <laughs> made a boatload of Lian selling Earth's skin rugs. <sighs> She's been you having did not. a yeah. dream for nearly She looks just like that girl. Yeah, yeah, I told you. Are you okay? Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, why? It's just that you seem a little not okay. Uh, guys, okay. I'm fine. Seriously. <laughs> Carden has been picking on you since the first week of school. Uh, who? Carden Winchester? Ah, 
He just likes to mess around, you know. Practical jokes. He's a bully. <laughs> oh, please. Name we hate one bullies. time. He's Dang right. Me. <laughs> no. Oh! Wow. Huh? Ah. <laughs> Each of you will be assigned one rocket-propelled locker to store your weapons and extra armor. Additionally, your locker can be sent to a custom in location locker, based on a six-digit code. What? Oh, wait. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> All right. I didn't land far from the school. Jean, you know if you ever need help, you can just ask. <laughs> we'll break his legs! Wait, what? Guys, really, it's fine. Besides, it's not like he's only a jerk to me. He's a jerk mm -hmm. to everyone. The shadow people. <laughs> oh, that's yes, us. the shadow people. <laughs> Please stop. Oh, she hit him over the head. I told you it was real. <laughs> what a freak. <laughs> oh, that would have been me. Oh, no. Atrocious. I can't stand people like him. Me neither. Exactly. He's not the only one. It must be hard to be a Faunus. So I wonder if those are her cat ears real, or and she, and she and she just has a bow in between to kind of disguise it. Really? Oh no, yep. they said it was real. Well, her cat ears? Yeah, that's what the uh, the guy said at the table. They said it's real. Well, no, 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 no. I'm talking about Blake. Oh, Blake. Are oh, those I cat don't ears, know. or is that a bow, or are those cat ears? And she just uses the uses the little thing in the middle to disguise it like it is a bow. Maybe. Who I have knows, no idea. man? We'll find out. But let's go on to the next episode. While you talk to the people while I get it right. Yeah, so, you know, here, okay, we see that John Ark has a bully. And, of course, he's trying to make it seem like, okay, I'm not the only one getting picked on here, but... He's like, it's okay. It's not okay. It is, That's what he's I, like I know, okay. but I'm just saying it's, it's never okay for one person to, to... You talk, I'll be right back. Okay. It's, oh, I get to sit in the chair? Oh, my goodness, the master chair. It is never okay for anyone to feel like, okay, just because I'm not the only one getting picked on. I, yeah, this really bothers me. It really bothers me. But it's never okay to be bullied. Never. I can't stay in the master chair? No, because you don't know how to work the controls. Oh, okay. Point taken. So, anyway. So, um, I, I'm ready for John not to kind of take a stance. Stand up for himself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand. Well, let's get right on with it and see what happens. Yes, yes, ah! due to the Faunus Rights Revolution, more popularly known as the Faunus War, humankind was quite, quite adamant about centralizing Faunus population in Menagerie. <laughs> that hair, though. Now, while this like looks Joker like almost history to many of you, it is imperative to remember that these are relatively recent events. Why the that well, so is a bow. It's a bow. The uprising can still be seen to this day. Now, have going. any among you been subjugated or discriminated because of your father's heritage? One shadow person and her. Dreadful, simply dreadful. Remember, students, it is precisely this kind what? of thing that breeds what? violence. Is it dreadful? Simply dreadful. I mean, I mean, I mean, just look at what happened to the White Fang. Now, which one of you young scholars could tell me what many theorists believe to be the turning point in the third year of the war? Yes. The battle at Fort Castle. Precisely. And who can tell me the advantage the Faunus had over General Lagoon's forces? Hey. Oh, Ray. This art finally good. is to class. This is excellent, excellent. What is the answer? Uh, the answer <laughs> the advantage uh the faunus had over that guy's stuff uh binoculars <laughs> i thought it was binoculars too i would have said binoculars. big ears, uh, ears. <laughs> big eyes ears very ears. funny mr ark cotton Perhaps you would care to share your thoughts on the subject. Mm -hmm. Well, I know it's a lot easier to train an animal than a soldier. You're not the most open-minded of individuals, are you, Cardin? What? Nope. You got a problem? No, I have the answer. Huh? It's Whoa. night vision. Many faunas are known to have nearly perfect sight in the dark. Uh... 
General Legume was inexperienced and made the mistake of trying to ambush the Faunus in their sleep. His massive army was outmatched and the general was captured. Perhaps like if he'd paid attention in class, he wouldn't have been remembered as such a failure. <laughs> Woo! Mr. Winchester, oh, shit! <laughs> you and Mr. Ark could both see me after class for additional readings. Mm. Oh. Now, moving on. Will there be more lattes? He is moving. Will there be more lattes? You go on ahead. I'll wait for Jean. <laughs> You two have been struggling in my class since day one. Now, I don't know if it's a lack of interest or just your stubborn nature, but whatever it is, it stops now. You've worked hard to gain entrance to the school, and we only accept the best of the best, so I expect you to act like it. History is important, gentlemen. If you can't learn from it, you're destined to repeat it. Pages right. 91. I want an essay on my desk by next class. Now... Run along. What the word is that? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I would have to. Uh, what he did, you know, yeah, I he really will break down. his legs. <laughs> Just let me break some legs. I have an idea. Here, come with me. Uh, yes! Behind the bleachers. Huh? Really? No. Why not? Because there's no football game tonight in this rain. Pira, I know I'm going through a hard time right now, but I'm not that depressed. I can always be a farmer or something. No! Man, she must like That's him. That's not why I brought you up here. That's right. Jean, I know you're sugar. having a difficult time in class. And that you're still not the strongest of fighters, so... I want to help you. What? We can train up here after class where no one can bother us. You think I need help? N no. No, that's not what I meant. Enhanced. But you just said it. Jean, yeah, you need help. everybody needs a little push from time to time. That's right. It doesn't make you any different from the rest of us. You well, made it to Beacon. That speaks volumes of what you're capable of. You're wrong. I, I don't belong here. That's a terrible thing to say. Of course you do. No, maybe, I don't. Maybe not. <sighs> I know more. Anybody say I you wasn't got really in? accepted into Beacon. Because somebody pulled some strings? What do you mean? I mean, I didn't go to combat school. I didn't pass any tests. I didn't earn my spot at this academy. I lied. Oh. I got my hands on some fake transcripts, oh. and I lied. Ooh. What? But... Why? Because this is what I've always wanted to be. My wow. father, my grandfather, and his father before him were all Good warriors. Pressure. They were all yeah. heroes. I wanted to be one we'll too. Talk about that at the end. I was just never good enough. Then let me help you. I don't want help. I don't want to be the damsel in distress. I want to be the hero. John, no, I'm tired be of being the lovable idiot stuck in the tree while his friends fight for their lives. Don't you understand? If I can't do this on my own, then what good am I? Stop pulling Just away when I'm trying to love alone. you. Okay? You can love on me. If that's what you think is best. Stop pulling away when I'm trying to love on you. What you mean? <laughs> oh, oh here he go. Carden? I couldn't help but overhear oh you two. God. Oh, God! So, you snuck into Beacon, huh? I gotta say, John, I never expected you to be such a rebel. Please, Cardin, please don't tell anyone. John, come on. I you never rat a friend like that. Probably get killed. A, a friend? Uh, of course. We're friends now, Johnny boy. And the way I see it, as long as you're there for me when I need you, we'll be friends for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> You're not his friend. You're his. said, I really don't have time to do Shall those extra it? readings Dr. Ubuck gave us today. I knew that was coming. Think you could take care of that for me, buddy? That's what I thought. Don't worry, Jean. Your secret's safe with me. Man. I mean, what you doing hiding, like, on the side of the building, though? How are you even there? Come on! So someone said that, wait a minute, they take place of this, and there's like a little... Preview thing for the next one or something like that. A little snippet. A little snippet. Let's see. Now. Now. Uh, 
No. Oh, okay. Okay, we're going to go with no on that one. We're going to go with the answer no. Okay. Well, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you something about that and how that goes. You cannot, you got to be who you want to be in life, right? Because my entire family, I just want to throw that phone sometimes. My entire family. I do. My entire family, it works two places. And, um, you know, they work for the power company and the rest of them in the military. And my entire life, that's what my dad wanted me to do. You know, uh, my mom wanted me to do it. That's what they thought, either going to go to the military or work for the power company. But I excel at computers and, and all sorts of technology, all this stuff. That's how I can do all this this stuff right here. But I, I, work for, I work in IT. And it took longer to make good money in IT. But once you make it, it's steady. And you don't have to worry about going down. There's always going to be a job for you. And it's just like, I think so many times if I had not not done what I wanted to do and not done it my way, and I had gone into the military or I had gone into uh, work for the power company, I'd probably be miserable unless I wanted to do it. Because maybe I would have wanted to do it, but it wasn't what I wanted to do at the time. If it was my choice to do it, it's completely fine. You know, if I had told, because I was going to try to go to the military, but I ended up not going because I tore my ACL, so I couldn't go. So, um, so, but you know, so when I chose to go, then, you know, I, I, I would have been fine. But when I felt pressured into going, then I, I knew I, I know I would have been miserable. And that was after I tore my knee up or whatever. So, you know, it is what it is, man. I like you gotta, you gotta to find your own way. Yeah, I think, you know, you always gonna have like family members that tried to push you. For me, they wanted yeah. me to be a teacher. Right. I was like, I know I was gonna be no teacher. I mean, you work in IT as well. Yeah. I mean, yeah. they like, you know, they, they people always. People can always plan your life out better than you than they can plan their own. Now this is insane, right? But you know, uh, if you want to do something, if you've got, if you've got a better idea or a better track, and you know, I'm not saying if your if your parents are telling you to go to college, don't don't come with them. I'm, I'm gonna be a rapper or something like. Stop. You can rap in college, and if you make it, you make it. If you don't, you don't. But uh, what I'm saying is, what I'm, what I'm really trying to say do what is, makes you happy. do what makes you happy. Within reason. Right. I knew that there was a good career for me in IT, and I knew there was a good career. You know, those were good alternate careers, but this is what I wanted to do. This is what makes me happy, and I'm happy now because of that. And I, mean, I don't want to be like John Art. I, I mean, that's what that kind of reminded and me of. And there's a lot of John Arts. That's, there that's are a like lot that of John Arts. And I worked with some of them that, that they went into IT because that's what their parents did, but they really wanted to go to the military as the other way around. A uh, guy that, we used to, that I used to work with, he went back to the military because he got out, worked in IT because his dad was like an IT rock star or whatever. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, he went back to the military. He said, IT ain't for him. He wanted to go uh, back into the military. And that was fine. So, you know, it, it works both ways. It works both ways. And like my sisters, they, they wanted to work for the power company. They, they, they wouldn't be able to do IT. Mm -hmm. So you got to do what makes you happy and what you're good at, you know, as well. And, and never feel like you can't take help. Right. Everybody needs help. Everybody somewhere. needs somebody sometime. Everybody needs some love sometime. Yeah, but so, you know, um, Pierre is just trying to just... She's just trying to help him. Like, you know... It's like, let, let me be there for you. Right, right, there's right. There's no shame in, in asking for help. There's no shame in receiving help. And right. there's no shame in offering help. Correct. That's very profound. That's very profound. Yes. Anyway, we're going to leave on that profound note. If you want to watch the original video, please go to the link that's in the description. And um, by the time we get to the next one, Bridget will have moved about two or three inches to the right so my whole body can be in here instead of just her whole body. Anyway, man, we're going to be up out of here. Look oh, and also, don't forget that uh, if you have not watched our 1K subscriber video, please go back to that video. For your chance to win something. For your chance to be entered in the getaway. Um, tomorrow, all the names will be entered, so anything after... Uh, Anything after tomorrow is not going to count. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Obviously, if you do it after we post a video, you're not going to get in. It's just, just simple. But anyway, like I said, we got to get up out of here, man. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, follow Bridget on, and, and me on Twitter and Instagram. Uh, she just posted some pictures of her going to Dragon Con where she saw the entire Ruby cast. So uh, check that out. And check out the last video because that's what she did in the last video, too. We, that's what that last video was about. She met the entire group of Ruby at Dragon Con yeah. and other people. It was exciting. And Deadpool. 
But anyway, we got to be up out of here, man. It's already a 20-minute video. We're going to holler at y'all until next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BBK, the Peep Champ. And it's your girl, Brent Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Slime, BBK, the Peep Champ. Holler! 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 Holler!